Davison has this night off. In just about an hour from right now, the Howard Village Board will meet, and several items they plan to discuss include possible new safety measures for the Duck Creek Quarry. Local 5's Aaron Taylor live now at the quarry with more on those proposals and what they could mean for swimmers out there. Aaron? Hey, Tom, on hot days like this one, the Duck Creek Quarry is the perfect spot to cool off. But safety concerns have continued throughout the summer. Now tonight, some village officials are hoping to address those concerns in several quarry-related proposals. One, two, three. There is no beach around here, so this is really a nice fit for the community. The kids are having a great time. As the dog days of summer drag on, the Duck Creek Quarry continues to attract swimmers and sunbathers alike. But safety concerns have persisted throughout the summer, especially for young swimmers in the quarry's deep waters. Honestly, it does drop off fast. And if you're not watching, and if the kids are comfortable with life jackets, I think that's the way to go. Water's dangerous, really deep water's dangerous. Um, but at the end of the day, if you use your common sense and you know your abilities, you should be fine. The village has already added some safety measures this season. I like the roped off part for the kids and we bring life jackets and um, water wings and keep an eye on the kids. But some additional safety features could soon be a part of the Duck Creek Quarry experience. The new features could include concrete steps down to the beach area, ladders for swimmers to climb out of the water, and more safety rings. So all three of these improvements are really safety prioritized improvements. Because a quarry isn't your typical beach. People kind of have gotten used to it, they kind of get trained on what to expect when they go to a body of water. So, And this is different. This is not Lake Michigan where you can walk out 100 feet and you're still up to your waist or not even as deep. So this has some different challenges. So we just want to give people an opportunity to always make good decisions and be safe. Now, other issues expected to be addressed tonight include whether or not smoking will be continued to be allowed on the beach and potential parking solutions. That meeting is expected to start at around 6.30 this evening. Stay tuned to Local 5 on air and online as we learn more about what happens in that meeting. For now, reporting live in Howard, Aaron Taylor, Local 5 News.